for joining me for MTI's Whiteboard Wednesdays. I'm Dan Adams. Today we're going to be talking about Friction Welding 101. Friction welding is a solid state joining process. It's not actually a welding process, it's a forging process. We use relative motion and high force in order to create frictional heat at the weld interface. This in turn heats the materials that you're trying to join up to the point where it will plasticize. You get intermixing at the weld interface and you end up with a forge quality joint. So the different types of friction welding have to do with the different types of relative motion. So for example, linear friction welding, I have one piece that's stationary and one piece that's oscillating back and forth. So for example, this piece can be relatively complex on the bottom with an oscillating piece on top and be able to join them. This allows me to have something that is relatively complex uh, and still be able to create a friction weld with it. Now rotary friction welding, I have one piece that's stationary and I have a second piece that's rotating. Only one of the two pieces needs to be symmetric around its rotating axis uh, in order to be able to make this weld. With friction stir welding, I have two stationary pieces that could be uh, sheet metal or an extrusion, and I have a non-consumable pin tool that is rotating and providing the force uh, for forging, and as it traverses along the seam, it leaves a forged wake in its path. So for example, I have four pieces of aluminum that I'm welding together, three different welds, using friction stir welding. The nice thing is the length of these parts can be as long as you need them to be. Now there are two other types of friction welding that are a little less common. Radial friction welding, I have a collar that I'm rotating and compressing onto the OD of a tube uh, or a bar. And then with orbital friction welding, I'm orbiting the two parts around their center axis uh, in order to create that relative motion. So no matter what type of geometry your parts have, we have a friction welding technique that will work for you. Thank you for joining us for this episode of MTI's Whiteboard Wednesdays. For more information on this topic or other friction welding solutions, please visit us at our website, mtiwelding.com.